Hi guys, welcome to Keto Canine and Reviews with Roman. I'm Roman, and my favorite time of the month came, my Keto Crate's here. I had started a previous video, and things went awry, so I had to stop the video and restart it. I didn't get, luckily I didn't get into anything yet. I was barely talking about the little pamphlet that comes in it. And I'm just going to zoom right through that. There is nothing in this pamphlet that's important this month. Um, there's some recipes. There's a recipe for avocado. Don't have time for chocolate pudding. Um, there is Leah's keto success story. Leah, you're beautiful. Um, there's a thing for getting back on track. Give yourself grace. Small steps forward. Check in with yourself. There is a recipe for deli roll with the punch. There is a recipe for quick and crispy pepperoni chips. And... I thought like there was another one. Oh yeah, and then there's two more. There's a recipe for coconut shrimp with peach sriracha dipping sauce and oh yeah, that that's it. I thought it was two, but it's just one. Which is weird. Like it's a peach dipping sauce, but we're not supposed to have fruit on keto, so like why? I don't do keto. I do low carb. I do dirty keto. But it's still a form of keto. That's why this channel is called Keto, because it's still a form of keto. Okay, so I was telling you that this, in the other video, that this was on here, and I didn't know why. And it turns out, because this isn't a, it's not a coupon or anything, it's just a piece of paper. And it turns out that this chocolate is in here. So, that's the first thing I'm going to show you, is Pure Organic Sugar-Free Chocolate Drink Mix. I might review this for you and I might not. I usually don't do things like you have to mix this up, but I might. I might end up doing it for y'all, so stay tuned for that in case I do that. It's just one serving size. I like Pure. Um, I have Swerve and Pure, and Pure is the one that I actually like using. So I think I'll like this, because I actually do like Pure. Like, I think I would use Pure even if I wasn't keto. Okay, so let's see. what The first thing up, well, that was the first thing. We have, secondly... An IQ bar. I've never had an IQ bar in a keto crate before. So this is the almond butter chip. And guys, in case you're in case you're new, I don't um, I don't review things during this video. I just tell you what's in it, and then I do individual reviews. So I'm just showing you what's in it, and then if you want to watch this certain thing, if you want to know what I think about this almond butter chip IQ bar, you have to wait for the video to come out because I will do an individual video on this. So this is the IQ Almond Butter Chip. And when I do the review, I give the ingredients and the nutrition facts, and I do a taste test. So again, this is the Almond Butter Chip IQ Bar. Next up we have... Better Than Good. I like the, I like the, the company Better Than Good. Better, better, better Than Good Veggie-Infused Protein Grab-and-Go Puffs Baked cheddar don't quote me on this but i think last month we got these and they were in or the month before and they were in the ranch flavor and i remember i told you that they tasted like fish food but i mean i i do like these they're better than cheetos and whatnot so these are baked cheddar so i think these are going to be kind of like cheese balls which will that will make me happy so there's that next we have Crunchy cheese in the black pepper flavor. This is just called crunchy cheese. Um, I imagine this is also going to be kind of like a play on like Cheeto Puffs. I don't know because it says it's just crunchy cheese in the black pepper flavor. They kind of, they don't, they feel more like, like puff cereal. Like, you know, like cocoa puff cereal. But we'll see about that. Next up we have dang coconut chips. I'm so glad that I got these. I've never had these before, but I'm so glad I got these because I was going to buy some coconut flakes for my um, keto chow um, shakes. And I don't have to do that because it came in here. So I will definitely be trying that for y'all. I've never had coconut chips in general, so I won't even know if these are good or bad because I've never had coconut chips before. But I feel like coconut chips are coconut chips. Like, they're not... They're either keto or then what is this? That was cold. <laughs> uh, this is Sun Yum Sunflower Seed Dip and Spread. 
and the garlic flavor. This is like a sauce dip. It says that it's a seed, it's a sunflower seed dip. Uh, kind of looks like pudding, <laughs> but it says it's in the garlic flavor, like this garlic flavored pudding, maybe. I don't know. But um, I guess y'all are going to have to stick around for that video because I don't know what this is. I've never seen this before. Next up, oh, I haven't had this. I haven't gotten this in a couple of months. It's Strive's B Biltong, and it's the original flavor. So I really like you know, getting Biltong in my keto crate. I really like Biltong. I like Biltong more than I have. Well, that's cold too. What is that? They keep giving me cold stuff. What is it? What is this? This is cold. Whoa, that's really cold. Bright Fox Night Light Hydrating Beverage for a Brighter Tomorrow. Blueberry and Vanilla. I guess this is a drink. This is probably going to be my first video because I have no idea what this is, but it's cold and I think it needs to go in the fridge. So I'm probably going to do this first because I have no idea what this is. So this is going to be my first video. Ah, that's, it's, um, 10 ounces. It's cold. And like, I think I'll reuse this as a water bottle because this is really, really, really cold. This is a good keto crate, guys. I'm, I'm thoroughly happy. Okay, so we have B lean, B lean bars with benefits. Jimmy protein bar. In the sh it's keto friendly in the strawberry nut. High fats, low net carbs. So I'm guessing this is a protein bar and it's strawberry nut flavored. Next we have Iota Umami Roasted Sunflower Kernels, Tamari and Apple Cider Vinegar. I've had the Iota, um, um, basically the chicken rinds, you know, like the chicken skin. But I didn't do a video on that because that wasn't even Keto Crate. That was something that was, I want to say that was my Keto Snack Box. And I hadn't started YouTube yet. I started YouTube a month later and that's when I started Keto Crate. But I did have their chicken skin. And it tasted like pork rinds with chicken and I prefer chicken. So I think I'll enjoy these. Hopefully these, I don't know. I've never had umami before or apple cider vinegar. I don't like vinegar. I remember I liked these. This is a good to go bar in the cinnamon pecan. I remember I got one like in my first keto crate and I think it was like it was like raspberry vanilla or something and I remember it tasted no or strawberry vanilla. I remember that it tasted like um vanilla cake with like strawberries in it. So I'm wondering if this is going to taste like cinnamon cake with pecans in it. These are really good guys. I like if you gave me this, I would not believe that this is a keto thing. These are really... Well, that one was really good. That was my only one I've ever had. Hopefully... And I mean, I love cinnamon pecan. So, hopefully this is going to be really good. And then... Oh! Huh? Okay. So, I got something called flackers. Uh, which are flaxseed crackers. And I've never had these before. These are going to be my first time having them. Uh, these are in the sea salt flavor, but <laughs> eh, maybe, I don't know. I was like, cause I was wondering what this was cause it looked like pudding and I was like, that's a really random thing to be putting in there. And this whole video I've been like, what is that? Like it, it, it looked like pudding, but, um, I think this is kind of like a, kind of like a chip and dip type thing where you're supposed to dip these in here. There's no instructions for keto crate, but I imagine. But I'm really glad that I like, I got these because like hopefully my urge for crackers will be gone. And I guess it came with the dip. I don't know. Let's see if there's anything else in here. Oh, yay, beef stick. Um, this is a Chicago beef stick in the kosher beef stick original flavor. So that'd be great. This is a really, really, really good keto crate. I'm really thoroughly impressed. And, oh, um, that was the last thing, guys. I think this is the shortest keto crate video I've ever made in my entire life. In my seven months of doing keto. And my four, like, four months of doing YouTube. <laughs> um, 
Yeah, I'm very satisfied with this keto crate. I was very upset last month because last month it was like pure protein bars and then a big bag of pumpkin seeds. Go back and watch that video. I was not impressed last month, but it seems like they redeemed themselves this month. So I'm going to go ahead and cut this video off so that I can go ahead and start the reviews. I hope y'all, if y'all don't watch my reviews, I hope y'all enjoy this and I hope y'all give Keto Crate a chance because I, I really love Keto Crate. As you see, I do Keto Crate every month and I look forward to it every month. I'm not sponsored by them or anything. They probably don't even, well, they know ex I exist because obviously I get from them. But they don't know I'm a YouTuber or anything. So this isn't sponsored. This is my own personal opinion that I love Keto Cray. Like when, when I'm struggling with not being very keto friendly, Keto Cray comes in and saves the day. Like, I mean, I got like a chip and dip type thing going on. So like, I'm very happy for that. Anyways, I'm going to cut this off and I'm going to start the actual reviews. I hope y'all have a great day. And if it is cold there like it is here in the middle of summer. I mean, if you're a fall type person. I love like fall type stuff. So I, like, I'm very happy that this happened. But if you're not enjoying it, I'm sorry. It'll be over soon. If you are enjoying it, sorry. It'll be over soon. And then it'll come back in a few weeks. Anyways, I hope you have a great day. Bye.